Welcome back to my channel. So for those who are new here, my name is Nicole. I'm now a third year teacher and we are just slowly enjoying the rest of our winter break. I have a couple more days left until I need to go back to the real world. So we're just enjoying the peace and quiet. So this break has been very relaxing. I really needed it. I was sick the first week and then we of course went to go see family and I'm feeling a lot better now. I think I just had like a sinus infection that I think one of the kids got me, but it's okay. Um, so we are now about to start 2024, which is so crazy to think about, but I'm so excited for it. So I figured I would go ahead and share my 2024 reset and goals with you. So if that's something you want to see, then just keep watching. Okay. So I have always tried to have a bullet journal with my goals and like all of that stuff. I've tried it. I don't think it has worked in the past, but I'm going to try it again. We're going to try to be a little bit more consistent and proficient with it. So I just got this off of Amazon and I've already wrote down my 2024 goals. So I'm going to share them with y'all. Okay. So one of my goals is to get 10,000 followers on TikTok which I think I'm at like 5,000 something. So halfway there, I really want to get 5k subscribers on YouTube. I'm at 900 right now. So we'll see how it goes. And then I want 3k followers on Instagram, which that's kind of harder to get because I feel like I'm not doing enough content on Instagram. I really want to read a hundred books and then I have my yearly library that I write down all the books I've read. So we'll see, we'll see. Um, I really want to drink three bottles of water each day, work out five times a week. I really want to get my savings account up. So Corey and I are going to be getting hopefully a house this year. We've already been renting. so. We'll see how that goes. I really want to build up my Pinterest and then my Teachers Pay Teachers account. I got rid of my Teachers Pay Teachers just because the money was being weird. It wasn't really going into my account like it should have. So I just got rid of it altogether. And then of course I want to run two half marathons because why not, right? I've kind of gotten Corey into running with me and he's really liked it. So we'll see if he'll run one with me. But other than that, I just have my January bullet journal already done. So each day I would write something positive that happened that day. And then notes in my habit trackers. And then I have my mood tracker and my sleep log. Then we have my water intake and then my cleaning tracker as well. And then just my month in review. from Starbucks saying that they're doing half off drinks today so we're gonna go grab Starbucks we're gonna go to the um, library drop off books grab some new ones and then hopefully by then the order for Walmart will be ready but I'm doing a deep clean later today and I'm going to record that and show y'all how I deep clean because there's this dad on TikTok that I really love and there's a lot of things that he's saying that we need to do that I haven't done. So I'm making a list. Yes, I might be checking it twice. <laughs> My mind's still in Christmas mode. Um, 
but I'm going to create like a to-do list of just really getting in a deep clean before this new year happens just because like I feel I can be so much more successful if I do start that habit now. So we'll do that and then we'll come back, unload the groceries and see what is left to do. Normally like my go-to meal is chicken nuggets and tater tots and of course we're getting to the age that that's going to start accumulating with the weight. So we're trying this um, like healthy diet kind of out. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and meal prep for that. We're just going to have sheet pan so it's veggies, um, sausage, and then rice. So we'll meal prep for that. So first book I got was Lessons Learned and Cherished. It's the teacher who changed my life. And it's a collection of messages from well-known artists like Oprah Winfrey. Um, gosh, I'm trying to find more. Okay, so it's like Oprah Winfrey, Brooke Shields. Misty Copeland, Jimmy Allen, all of those, they wrote letters about their teachers. This is a nonfiction book, so I just wanna kinda of read it just because it's about teaching. This other one is Cold War by Lisa Thomas, Thompson, Thompson. Um, I've seen it all over my Instagram page and it's a cute, it looks cute. It's about a book in Keeper and her coworkers, so I kinda of wanna read that. This one is Court of the Vampire Queen by Katie Robert. I've also read a couple of her other books. She does a lot of romance novels for Greek gods, and I like her a lot. So there's that. And then I have one more. It's um, Baiting Him by Aurora, Aurora Rose Reynolds. Again, I've read some other series from her as well. They don't have the complete collection, which kind of bums me out. Um, but this is the second book in the series. So I have four books that should last me through January. If not, then we'll just make another trip. Okay, so with that being said, we are gonna go ahead and end off our journey here. I truly do hope 2024 brings you nothing but joy and just a thrivingness of adventures because right now we need 
compassion and we need love and we need understanding more than ever. And I truly hope that that finds its way into your life. But if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can join our little family. But I love you so much and I can't wait till our next adventure. Bye guys. Not gonna see me bleed Cause baby I got you, 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 you I've been beaten to the ground Dragged across the dirt